It looks magical. Oh my goodness, dude. Wow. <laughs> What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. More importantly, welcome back to another insane food challenge. Electric Empire, we are getting into another authentic ethnic food challenge after my last ethnic food challenge that was a Chinese food challenge. You guys absolutely love that video. It has almost actually, it has over 300,000 views right now. I took down 10,000 calories of Chinese food, all because you guys voted for it. And the second most voted option was to take down a bunch of Indian food. And you guys have been suggesting this one over and over and over again. So you know what, everyone? I thought, why not make a massive Indian curry challenge? All of this delicious curry that you guys are about to see in this food challenge today came from a local spot here in San Diego, California called Tandoori Express. They make a lot of great Indian food and it's perfect because with what's going on in the world, I feel like it's best to support local businesses, local food spots, and uh, just try to give back as much as possible. What you're about to see in this food challenge tonight, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be insane because we have a lot of rice, we have a lot of curry, we have a lot of deliciousness, we have naan, we even have some dessert, and it's all going to go on this massive platter right here. We're going to make a massive Indian curry challenge. So ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, it's time to make a massive Indian curry feast. I'm about to try to make $130 worth of curry and rice fit on this platter. Oh my gosh, it's so much rice. Chicken curry to start us off. <laughs> oh man. Oh, Seafood curry anyway? <laughs> it looks magical. Oh my goodness, dude. Wow. <laughs> oh wow. This looks magnificent. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, can we just take a moment, folks, to just admire this massive platter of curry. I I didn't actually do any home cooking for this one. I, I guess I probably could have, but wow, this is this is massive. This is gonna be this is gonna be delicious. Ladies and gentlemen, this thing is giant. This has got to be at least eight pounds of curry, maybe even ten pounds of curry. This thing is giant. I gotta say once more, big shout out to Tandoori Express for making this all happen. We have some pita. I can't believe I just called that pita. We have some naan on the side over here. We have some cheese naan, some garlic naan, and also some dessert right here, folks. We also have some Diet Coke because you guys know I'm gonna have my beverages. And um, also, I'm not really too sure how spicy this is. Just gonna throw that out there to you guys. So I have some almond milk. Guys, I'm excited to get into this one. Uh, before we do though, Electric Empire, like always, I gotta ask you guys because I love doing these, these ethnic food challenges, what you guys want to see next. So please let me know down below in those comments. Let me know what you guys wanna see next for another cuisine style challenge because there's a lot of options when it comes to all that. So let me know down in the comments below. Like always, before we get into this challenge, Electric Empire, I need to let you guys know the total calories that are in this challenge. Those are gonna be listed like right there. And total macros, that means protein, carbs, fat, sodium, all that good stuff. Those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. Without further ado, my friends, my family, members of the Electric Empire, this is the massive Indian curry challenge. Whew. Let's do this. Already Electric Empire, we are ready to get this challenge started. We are ready to get this one underway. I just gotta say, I'm actually very, very, very hungry today. Anyways, like usual, everybody, what you guys gotta do right now, Electric Empire, if you guys happened to poop today, you guys gotta give the video a like. If you happen to poop today. I feel like I just messed that up, but <laughs> oh well. It's been a long day. I have my water, of course, over there, and uh, I think we just gotta dive straight into this, everybody. I'm gonna grab some just in case. Just in case. If you know, you know. You know what, we're just gonna get dirty. We're gonna get messy with this one. It's time to start this challenge, everybody. And we're gonna start with the shrimp. Here we go. That's delicious. Now, let's get into this challenge. Ugh. 
got to say, everybody. So far, so good. This is absolutely delicious, super flavorful, and actually not really that spicy. So, Electric like Empire, we have a good majority of this. Actually, no, definitely not a good majority of this down. It's got, like, I can't even really even see what I've been eating just because there's like a mountain of rice in front of me, but wow, so far it's, it's going absolutely amazing. Well, I'd say definitely 30% of our curry is down. You guys can see right there, my mouth has been obliterated by curry right now. Whew, okay. And now everybody, it's time to take this up a notch with some naan. Everyone, naan is absolutely delicious. I uh, I gotta say that it's it's definitely something, I, I love naan, I pretty much love all carbs. Let's just, let's just be honest here, everybody. Okay, let's just be honest. Now, according to a few commenters on my second channel, where I, I ate Indian food with, with my girlfriend in a video, there's a particular way you're supposed to eat Indian food. So I did a little, did a little research before we came into the, to tonight's food challenge and um, definitely got to put the curry and the rice inside of the naan. And then you make yourself a curry and rice naan sandwich. And then you enjoy, just like so. And here we go. I mean, doesn't it just look so beautiful? Shrimp, rice, curry, amazing. Rice is like never ending. Ooh. All right, electric and fire wall. We are getting further into our curry. We gotta bring out an old familiar friend here. And you know what, this is definitely not a part of Indian cuisine at all, everybody, but you know what, I'm an American, and um, I'm going to add in an American condiment to this challenge, and you know, we're gonna go from there. Ranch naan curry, bucket, here we go. Damn you! No! Damn you! Oh, folks, all of our non down. Actually, no, we have our cheese on. We have our cheese on. I love non, but ordering that much non is probably not the best idea. Uh, next, we're going to get into our cheese non. I gotta say, everybody, I'm most likely going to be visiting the bathroom non stop. Non stop tomorrow. I had to fill that one as you guys. Get away. Get out of my sight. Well, everybody, we have cheese naan. I'm not really sure how this has got cheese on it or in it, but we're about to find out. Hopefully, it's going to be just like a quesadilla. Here we go. It tastes like normal naan to me. All right, guys, well, all of our naan is down. Ooh, I have no idea why I got that much stuff. Sorry, but it's just the massive amount of rice is just hitting me right now. Ooh, it kind of reminds me of one of my first challenges I ever did. Massive seven pound chicken fried rice challenge. So this is definitely not chicken fried rice. This is a lot of, a lot of curry. We have a little bit, actually no, this does not feel like it's a little bit, I would say probably 30% of our curry left. I gotta get into whatever these are. Um, I'm having a savory overload right now, so I'm gonna get into some of this dessert. Now here's the thing everybody, I don't actually remember what, oops, what these are. They look like little red dough balls, like balls of raisins and whatever that deliciousness is. I'm actually gonna put a little description right there on the did you know for whatever these are. I mean, they look, honestly, they look balls. 
Like, I'm not even trying to be weird or anything. They, they look, they're just balls. Take a gander at my balls. Of sweetness. Anyways, it's time to try these out. Here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, that is gonna get a W. Oh. W woman. That is amazing. Wow. Curry is delicious, but the rice. It's, whew. We're doing situations like this, everybody. We switch up our flavor profiles here. By the way, there's nothing left in that. Because when you have a savory overload in your mouth, uh, yeah, it definitely doesn't feel too good. I just gotta say, I am so glad that I got these. They are saving the day and night. Ooh. Oh my goodness gracious. I knew this would be pretty rough, but this rice is really starting to, actually it's definitely not starting, it's definitely impacted me. Ooh, man. Gotta do it though, folks. I gotta do it. Gotta do it. All right, folks. If you guys are still oh, with the flow of the video, if you're still with me, I'll let you get right one. I need you guys to comment down below. Is India. Because to everyone out there in India, I dedicate this video to you. You guys are awesome. And just like that, Electric Empire, there has been another video. <sighs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know down below and let me know what you guys want to see for the next ethnic food challenge for me. And also folks, if you want to keep watching more Eric the Electric, be sure to check out my playlist down below. The party does not have to end here. Thanks again for watching the video, everybody. See you guys next week.